the Marine. Let me see your war face. I've seen just about all the guns you have in your collection, but not this one. Do you think you have? <laughs> This one is on loan. A good friend of mine, he uh, got Nighthawk Custom. This one they do not offer anymore as a catalog item, as a special order. I don't know the model number. Uh, I'm sure they could piece one together. This one costs $4,200. That's $4,200 for one gun. But it's a 45 and it's 1911, so a lot of people think it does not get any better than that. We're going to do a standard of five shots in three seconds of the sheet of paper from about 10 feet or so. We'll see how this goes. Ready? Yep. Stand by. <laughs> 1. 1.61. Made it. Stand by. 2.23. And debris everywhere. Hey, David, you think you can hit that uh, clay pigeon out yonder? Yes, I can. That's why you use ear muffs, because the, oh, the, oh. the, the plug kept falling in. <laughs> <laughs> but oh, one thing about shooting is it's loud. you gotta have yeah. got to have muffs. I just wish it was quieter. If there's only there is some way, some way to make it look quieter, I, I, it's got to be... That won't work. When you got it out of the bag, I noticed the raised sight, so I gathered raised it was suppressor ready. Suppressor ready. It yeah. has a threaded muzzle. This is the muzzle protector. That's just cool. Yeah. <laughs> now you're ready to kill spies. You plan ahead. Yeah. That's a lot of fun. <laughs> Hang you on. Do, you do have to plan ahead. <laughs> they don't tell you that in the movies. No, they don't. <laughs> it goes well, I could on, just and hold on, it. on and on and on. No muffs, no earplugs. Yeah, I have little experience with this, so I'm kind of... We'll see. I'll shoot for the head first. Well, that's cool. Yep. Yeah. Makes it sound even quieter than a 22. I must concur. Yes. This is a 45 ought to. <laughs> yes. Go for that uh, clay pigeon. Yeah. No. Yeah. Less kick, too, <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even wake the neighbors. <laughs> this is my suppressor. The gun I put it on is not this quiet. Well, that's not a 1911. This one is. Contrary to popular opinion, uh, you still can get suppressors. They're working on legislation to make them more accessible for the hearing protection. I don't know how much a chance that has in the Democrat Congress. No. But, you know, it's still out there, and these are still legal. You know, they have been tightly regulated since 1934, so it's not like, uh, you know, they've been legal for a long time, since 1934. It's more than just getting a new barrel, too, with the threaded uh, barrel. You're going to have to have some raised sights because this takes up considerable vision uh, on traditional guns. But if you have a need for it, it's certainly fun. You have to put in the federal paperwork. You have to pay a $200 uh, transfer tax stamp. It's kind of like the uh, Wilson Combat. I think there is some, uh, some tie between uh, Nighthawk Custom and Wilson. I'm not sure what they are. Former employees, friends, whatever. Uh, but quality work either way. And... Uh, it's a really nice gun. If we could bench it, I'm sure we'd shoot like uh, quarter-sized groups at about uh, 25 yards. The gun can do it, whether yeah. we can do it, uh, <laughs> I don't know about that, but the gun can. It's a lot of money for a 1911. There are less expensive ones, but it, you know, you get what you pay for. But it's a lot of gun. It is, with or without the suppressor. And as always, guns, guns for, for everybody. everybody.